Chelsea, you just wrote an article in Time magazine um, uh, where you open up about your ang you have an anxiety disorder. Yes. And you I talk have about a it. mental illness. And I want people to know that if you have anxiety, depression, whatever your mental illness may be, you are not alone. And it just makes me feel better to know that I'm not alone. And I know you struggled yeah. with postpartum yeah. um, as well. And uh, there are 44 million Americans that are suffering from mental illnesses. So to me, I think we have to rededicate ourselves to really making mental illness a priority. Um, because what, what happened to you? Well, I've struggled with anxiety disorder my whole life. I just overwhelmed and I was working at the time and, and it, it, it feels like someone's wringing out a washcloth and I get shaky mm. and I can't breathe. and um, Like a panic attack. I actually went to a mental institution. A you public walked in yourself? I asked, I went into an emergency room and asked to speak to the psychiatrist and oh. had them drive me to, I looked t totally fine. And that's the thing mm. with mental illness yeah. is you look yeah. totally fine. You're fine. You could go for a hike. Mm -hmm. It's a big change yeah. having a baby. And I woke up seven hours later to 32,000 responses. Mm -hmm. I got married in a really intensely emotional time. I've been having nightmares. I was too worried I would burst out of my dress. <laughs> How does it feel today, darling? Where do you think I'm here? <laughs> Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez continues to be a rock star in the Democratic Party. Watch. I mean, moderate is not a stance. It's just an attitude toward life of like, mm, meh, or uh, intellectually superior attitude. A right-wing radical but position. That's, but that's, <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> Are they, are they a heart attack victim or are they resting? Are you okay? Oh my God!